Hello, and now we are the Grim Bros. We are back. Welcome, everyone. Um, we say we are the Grim Bros. We're after already done that. Just a change of pace. Yeah, sure. <laughs> right now, let's figure out where I have to go. Catch you later. <laughs> Come on, break. Oh. Uh huh. Oh, I'll just be. Out here for just a second, ref. I'm sure you can uh, talk plenty. Uh, no, I can't. But okay. Because <laughs> you know I haven't exactly been doing much of that anyway. I why can't I eat that guy? <laughs> yeah, your powers activate. You need a power to destroy. All right. Where am I going? Is this a door I can go through? No. She answers that. Oh, I bet. See you later, suckers. Uh, see, I don't really have anything to talk about. To be quite brutally honest. Um. Wait, was that it? Oh, no. Flax. I hate Flax. No, not 40 below. I hate him even more. Um. See, I don't really know what to talk about. But. This is a, that's a question actually that no one's actually asked so far. Uh, anyone watching this, if there are any people watching it, I want to know what your f if you played Cameo before, or even just based off design-wise, I would like to know what your favourite of the spirit appears to be, and what changes you would make to some of the ones that you like less. I mean. Part of my problem is that a lot of the spirits feel kind of redundant as the game goes on. They're kind of used... Well, let me guess it's going to jump. Yeah, it's just jumped. Oh, it's jumping away! A change of events has occurred. Can I... Yep, I'm back. Hey. Those, uh, rolls the old struggle was experimenting with. Um, because he, he loves to cook things and all that. Um, made some uh, mozzarella, tomato, and cheddar rolls. Really, really nice. Flex. Like, um, the, the tomato is lovely in them. Um, come on. Come on. Come he's on. also made some uh, plain sausage and bacon bits rolls. Some ah! Sausage rolls with bacon bits in them. But, um, Got you. We need to wait. I need to wait for them to cool down before I can try any of them. So yeah, I literally skipped out on you just to go food and churn food. Hey, that's fine. I've skipped out on you just to go to sleep, so... Or just, or just because you were annoying me <laughs> with your incompetence. <laughs> Please, I'm always competent. <laughs> that's what I think of you. <laughs> yes. Follow. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I don't know. Let's eat someone's heart. Oh. That healed almost nothing. I need more Well, hearts. that's because you ate someone's heart. That's not, you know, a healthy diet. Where are more hearts? Now, if you found a chicken in the uh, wall, that's a, that's a healthy diet. That's, a, that's really healthy. Or All in right. a dumpster. So I'm going to use, presumably, Flex and this. 40 here. Below. Yeah, I know what he's called. They just don't need to recognise his name. <laughs> because it's, suddenly the game just starts screaming out, Use 40 Below! Use your wings, Cameo! You have them for a reason! Uh, so... Whoa! That's a fast fella. Considering why it is. Yeah, I'm just gonna straight up ask Orphus for help. Orphus. Greenfire's eyes are clearly a weak point, but they can't be destroyed directly. I wonder if you can <laughs> knock them off the cliff instead. Okay. Yeah, fine. So I'm assuming grab its eyes with flex? Yes. I knew it'd use flex, but you have to be so... Oh wow, you don't get given much time there. I think I have to do something first, to be fair. Hmm, maybe. Can I like make it vulnerable? Nope. No. Uh Forty Blow is useless. Um Maybe it has a use in this fight, but I'll just try. I think no, I'm too close. 
Um, it's obviously a moment where it's you know got its uh, claws stuck. Yeah, that's that mine just walked off a cliff. The eyes are supposed to go off a cliff, not yourself. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Do you just have something against, cl you know, do you, does Cliffs have something against you? You can't even increase the range of his attacks. Jesus Christ, you really Because you and suck. Cliffs are usually a very bad combination. Yeah. I mean, is he even trying to hit me? She, it. We'll get... Well, we'll get somewhere we'll eventually. Well, he's not even highlighting them, to be fair. Mm, yeah. Orphus, tell me some more. Orpho. Is that it? Really? Just one tip. Collect one of the spirits. Will enhance your warriors. That'd be rather sad if Flex has no use at all. Yep. Well, this just God this. would not surprise me. Oh! That worked! Storm! I'm actually going to do anything. And you can't pick them up. Hmm. Might be helping. Nothing. That's nope. just killed me, actually. Wow, it was doing damage to you. Apparently. This is a confusing boss. So I guess I just have to use Chiller. The whole fight is just Chiller. From the seams of it, it doesn't seem like you're managing to use anyone else. Like, does that not seem a little bit redundant? Yeah. Eros is held helplessly inside Queen Fire. The only way to free him is to destroy her once and for all. What's your putting on the ice? It's a long way down. And I guess the, uh, oh no, pop right. I mean, who else can I... Pop right. Oh, Deep Blue, maybe. No. No? Nothing. Pummelweed won't do a thing. Rubble, rubble is rubble. Yeah, I expected that much. Yeah. Maybe I'll just get it to... Ow. I mean, that didn't even land on you, you just touched it. That shouldn't it. hurt you, it's been just, you know, really cold. That clearly does nothing. Mm, no damage to it. Hmm. Is it just unkillable? <laughs> yeah. Well, what now, Orpho? Anything? Jello can strike this demon right in the eyes if your timing's good, but you'll need fully blow to knock the eyes away once for all. Don't stay in one place for too long. Okay, so I have to use... 40 below, but with what? Okay, cool. This? It's working, maybe? I'm sure it's doing nothing. You got blower, frostbite, and snowball. Yeah. What's so... frostbite? Frostbite's to breathe. Oh, but... oh. Oh, there we go. Wrecker. Wrecker is how you do it. Yeah, it's working. Some of them are just saying. Oh, wow, this is going to take a long time if you do that each, oh, each of these eyes. They explode into so many of them. So, Flex is useless, basically. Maybe he's going to be the core character you have to use for the final boss. Oh, Jesus! You have a really strange interpretation. Oh, no, I took out two eyes with. That. Ah, okay, so okay, that makes things much better. That does like nothing. Yep. Mm, that's strange, I figured you would hit nine. Uh, I'm pretty sure I did hit an eye. I'm not sure closing your eyelids is supposed to protect you from icicles. 
There we go. Oh, you hit two again. I think it might just be you hit two. Anyway. That's deceptive. Yeah, it is a little bit. Mm, I'm trying to think of mm, other mm, things to talk mm. about. Um, mm. How are you actually supposed to figure out how to do this? I guess... Well, Trial and error? Well, the chiller thing seems logical. The chiller thing is logical. But the Wrecking Ball doesn't seem as logical. There's no been no other point that you have to use that ability. No. Nor have they actually explained... I've expected Deep Freeze or Flex to be used. Yeah, well... Because deep, you know, to be fair, so the only deep, thing they really through, explained sorry. of this guy was basically he can skate yeah. on ice paths. Yeah, yeah. you were expected. I was I, I was expecting you know some knock the opponent, and then there'd be like ice path segments to climb up. There might still be ice path segments in a bit. I don't know. I can't remember really. There's only one eye. Yeah, but one eye is not the end of oh. Queen Fire. Her eyes just walked off cliff. Yeah. Which is weird, you'd think that'd be the, you know, one part of her body which would have the best sense of direction. <clears throat> oh no, I... she's just got another bigger eye. One last eye. She's got to slowly dodge past all these. And then you'll have your chance. There you go. Oh my god, that thing is hideous. Oh god! Nope. No, I'm guessing I just have to throw more spikes at it. Catch you in hell, sucker. Maybe it's flex. Oh, no, it stopped. So yeah, maybe it's finally flex's time to shine. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. We do have flex. Yeah. No. It just... Wow. The it, it's literally Yeah. Got no spikes on it and Flex can't grab it. I swear to god if you try and go back in your husk of a body. Yeah. You literally just knocked it into its husk of its body. Well to be fair, its body was also hurting me somehow. Just by being dead. Like walking into a Goomba. Alright. So. Oh, what? Went around for a bit first? Yeah, I know. It's pretty. Pretty simple, isn't it? And let's get it away from its dead body. But yeah, it, when I eventually find a sort of. Uh, you know, an external hard drive that works, or if I can get my external hard drive I do have to work. I wanted to sort of, you know, be able to download a bunch of virtual Come on. console games. Come on. There's, there's plenty of Super NES ideas, but when it came to the NES ones, it was a very small list of ideas. I'd like to play the original Punch Out. Um, Blaster Master looked a really cool game. Um, sort of like the two different sort of like gameplay styles. And I guess because it only came out in Japan and Europe, I want to play Euphoria the Saga. Or as it's spelled, Euphoria THE SAGA! Um Okay, I swear to god. I'm going to be so glad when this thing is dead. Yep. And Euphoria the Saga just looks terrifying. Why? Just the well Euphoria is a weird series in that it's made by Sunsoft, I believe. And Euphoria is their mascot. He's apparently started like 31 different games. Not a single one of them has been the same game. Oh. Like, it's always a different style of game completely. Euphoria the Saga, from the looks of it, I believe is like one of the only ones which came out worldwide. Well, not worldwide, but outside of Japan. Um, and... You know Lil Samson? Yeah. It kind of looks like it plays like that. You know, you've got multiple, multiple characters and you go through a level like that. Hmm. Except all the designs are... Yeah, there we go, finally! Adorably stupid. It's eye just exploded. Yep. It shouldn't technically kill its main body. It should just make it, you know, blind, live it's eye and, socket, live a, and live a miserable, it's eye socket agonizing life. doesn't even... Oh no, it's trying to kill me. And it broke its own legs. Oh no, you're going to kill the old man! Oh no, oh, no it's probably just going to break ah. off all its legs. 
Oh, no. Oh, no, no. the old man's dead. Wow. Oh, no. just missed him. Jesus Christ, I could have died there. He's also... Why would you do that? You could have just got a pickaxe or sink and broke its back. I hated that. Yep. Uncle Yeros, but where do I come from? I don't know. I'm a senior old gnome. Only that I was adopted. Who told you, Dad? I'm going to need to break their legs. Unfortunately, not even we are. You were found in a stable. Unfortunately, yes, you're just a Jesus allegory. There was no father. I'm going to tell you around so I'm serious about. You're like my own personal Jesus Christ. So I've been watching some nostalgic great fish, just seeing the hilarious <laughs> Several days after his disappearance, we heard cows screaming from the guns. Five elemental sprites carrying baby. Oh. Your father slept around a lot, and that's why you were born! <laughs> Apparently, the father died, and all that was left of him was five elemental spirits, poor soul. I was the father reincarnated into Cameo. That's disturbing. Oh. And with this power, you could rule and crush all! So Cameo killed Solon, <laughs> stole his power, and then got brought. To the family. Your cameo, daughter of Solon. I'm going to kill my husband when I finally find him. I was part of what happened to you. She's not that we know much about that either. He just kind of died. Solon was the idiot who let fall in, uh, uh, fall into the lands and didn't bother to keep track of the trolls to make sure they weren't being led by a nut job. Funnily enough, it was the trolls that killed him. Apparently. Um. Vanished without trace at nearly the same time. And now that I think about it, how so they miss the fact weird stuff that the happened. Warlords held several of the elemental sprites. Uh, paranoid mention. ramblings of an old man. And there is one thing I do know for sure your mother would want you to have this. Now, is this the overpowered one or the one I want? It's the one I want. Ah, your favorite. So, where do I get the OP one? I need one more shadow oh, troll to hunt down and the whatnot will be full. <sighs> Jesus Christ, 100 gamer points for plot. It is in the Ogre Swamp. Yeah. Just tell me there. How to get there and I'll what? Finish the an Ogre but, Swamp? But, oh, gosh. <laughs> Let's see, where, where's... Donkey! Um, I, I would bring up this other point I have. Actually, no, I'll, I'll And he exploded in flames, dying horribly and painfully. I've been trying to list, like, some of my favourite games, and I basically decided, you know what, I should do it based off systems, because that'd be easier. And maybe at some later point. Look at him. Look how like, I'm pretty sure I did uh, my favourite... Uh, I've done my top 12 favourite video games already. But it was funny when I got to the GameCube. Look. Because I managed... This is his attack. <laughs> Because there are many GameCube games I loved, and you know, they also just eat people. And so I made a list of my favorite also, GameCube games. Also, we should games. probably end. And on number six, above the likes of Tales of Symphonia, Super Smash Bros. Melee, and Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles, example, number six for my favorite GameCube games includes Shrek 2. I mean, it is a beautiful game. It is a wonderful game. But still, oh, Jesus, Shrek 2. <laughs> It's beautiful. It is pretty much the best movie game. Like, even better than Spider-Man 2. Shark 2 is just amazing. As a movie game. But yeah, yeah, we should end with you do your creepy thing with your plant guy thing. He's brilliant. <laughs> no. Cheerio, everyone! See you later!